Hi, my name is Justin Conway. Today I'm going to talk about taking a uh, Word form, something that's in uh, Microsoft Word, and uh, putting it into the format of Excel. So pasting it into Excel and making that information accessible in, uh, in that program. So uh, let's start with uh, the blank Excel sheet that I have here. Uh, let's say we want um, some information that we have in this Word document that I have open to come on over to this area. Um, this this question is uh, sort of sort of a common question, and it has it has different meanings. So depending on what kind of form you want, you may want to um, transfer that information in different ways. But um, to maintain the integrity of that form, um, you'll have to play with it a little bit and see what works best for you. The first uh, first one that I'll cover, and the one that usually works best for me, is simply copy and paste. So if you have a table, something like this. Um, and if it were a form that had buttons and things that you can enter information in, um, hopefully you'd be able to select the entire thing just by selecting the table. And you can copy, uh, Control C or Command C, and go into your Excel sheet and select Paste. And the information will actually go right into the cells, uh, all displayed very nicely. Um, now going back to talking about buttons real quick, uh, sometimes buttons don't transfer that easily. You may have to do them one at a time, select each button, or you may have to do a um, select all option to select everything on the page. Um, and that way, uh, it'll hopefully grab the buttons as well. You'll be able to copy them, paste them over. And then sometimes the information would need to be recreated really in order to have the proper formatting options and things like that. So if, for instance, we had buttons here and we wanted them to be in Excel, what you could do is go into the uh, developer area, click radio button, or any of these other buttons that you have here, whatever the type of form is that you'd like to, to use, and, uh, and start creating them um, from there. You can add the different options. So um, the short answer is to copy and paste. Uh, if that doesn't work, you'll have to play with it a little bit. Um, but uh, then another option is if you want to just simply link that form. Um, very quick and easy. Uh, you can just always go to Insert and Object from File, select the um, the document that you'd like to have and click link to file and now all of that information will be in your document and linkable back to the to the first document. Um, now this information does not live in the Word document per se, it's really information that's being pulled, uh, I'm sorry, it doesn't live in the Excel document per se, it's pulled from the Word document um, but that's another way to get the information in and it's formatted correctly. Um, so that's how to uh, link the information and um, have the information accessible. And my name is Justin Conway. I hope that helped. Thanks.